if you do find yourself having to have that unpleasant conversation, and you should extricate yourself. I mean, again, it is the student's rights. You should, if you're in the room with the principal, and the principal is trying to tell you why you should censor the paper or why he should censor the paper, the last thing you want to do is to get bogged down in a legal argument. That's bad because why? First thing that's going to happen is now he's going to call his lawyer, and now we got lawyers involved, and the school lawyers have no idea what the First Amendment says most of them, so we're just not going to make any progress that way. So you want this to not be a legal argument at all. You want it to be, what did I say? I said, you're a loyal employee of the school, and so here is, you are speaking. Everything that you say to that principal has to be, Mr. Principal, I'm doing this because it's in the best interest of the school. I'm doing this because it is protective of the school, whether you realize it or not, okay? Here is what is going to happen, Mr. Principal. You've got no idea. This could get so much worse. If this winds up, if the ACLU gets involved, if these kids get lawyers, if they go to the news media, if they start their own website, you're going to give this thing so many legs. You're going to give this so much life. It's just what Obi-Wan Kenobi said right before Darth Vader nailed him in the first Star Wars. If you strike me down, you make me more powerful than you can possibly imagine. 